Greetings, this is Darvain and welcome back to Let's Play Elder Scrolls Arena. Now, finished the looting and we return back to town. Now, I could very easily just go back outside and do the whole thing again. But I don't want to. There's other places to explore out there. So I think we are going to find a nice inn. Which one is it? 9.43 in the morning. Let's, let's have a nice inn. Spend a, find a nice inn. Okay, let's find where is the nearest inn. And you've shown me. What have you given me? You've shown me the Queen's Chests, okay. Which is, ironically, that one right there. An influential figure called Diet nervously draws you aside as you approach the bar. You are precisely the sort of red god I've been looking for to escort my stepdaughter three pam to Kazim's professional supply store. I know it's probably out of your way, but if you can get him there by Turdas tenth of her fire, you will be at least 126 gold richer. I will see it that my contact at Kazin's professional supply store will pay. Will you agree to help me? Yes. Free gold for an escort quest. Thank you, Darren. My mind is much eased. Good luck to you, good red guard. find someone to talk to who might know where uh, what is it we are looking for Kazin professional supplier store Uh, it must be close by because you just shown us it on the map and it's literally next door, okay. But I think you'll find this is it here. Good day to you, Free Pammy, and to you, Red Guard. I am pleased you have taken such good care of the Jet Step before. I'm sure it was a him. Okay. Question is, is that is that a uh, algorithm ever, or was there really trans individuals back in 1994? in the Empire of Tamriel. We'll never know. Your hundred face gold is well deserved. Enjoy it and fare ye well. Okay. Not only do we get gold for that, we also get a small amount of experience. There uh, okay-ish way to gain experience if you need and indeed cash if uh, you're not for just diving in and looting a, looting a uh, dungeon somewhere but 
yeah, after that diversion. Let's have a drink of our well-deserved extra money. Let's have a... Well, you know what? I like, I like cider. Let's have another cider. Just the one day. Okay, five hours of field and we are in here. That's a two story. Didn't realise that this is a two story tavern. Since it's not technically a dungeon, these are just the upstairs rooms. I mean, technically, we could break in here, well, sort of, and just. yeah. You remember there were two other sites of interest we were thinking about exploring we have that se that cemetery dungeon and whatever that place on the island is Either way, we are going to go and explore. By the way, do um, leave me feedback on how you want this game to progress. I mean, would you rather I kind of sped run it for some of the plot, or are you quite happy with me just exploring the wilderness? Is that something that you'd be interested in watching? Let me know. As always, this, as I said, this is a this is a game where you are rewarded for going off the beaten path. Remember, that's where the tower was. They're still there. I don't know if it's the same. I, ca I, I can't actually tell you because I can't mem. I haven't memorized all of this. If um, whether it's whether these wilderness maps are the same but I think they might well be because there's a hint in the manual that there's a dungeon outside Ebenhold which is essentially a exactly the same as these sort of dungeons which makes me wonder if these are all fully mapped as well just kind of modularly designed full, fully mapped you know which means yeah you could have fun exploring like every town and their wilderness and all of that and they might be the same between games never know okay so this is us uh, just to check 
check we are. Yeah. Actually, how is our how is our dwarven longsword doing? Still bad. It won't last very long, especially against the door. Okay, so this is a crypt. And as you can see, it is another simple basic pre plan map. So it's only one level, it's slightly easier than the towers we've done possibly. I don't actually know. This is one we can... loot and then get back and then leave what is the yeah okay I was distracted by that loot there let's ask where are we I told you it wouldn't last very long, didn't I? Like I said, that's why we carry spares. I'm going to spare me sword on that one. Here's that door there. Rats can open the doors. Okay. Oh, we got a. Yeah, okay. I want to keep that. Regardless of what it is, I want to keep that.
Okay, there's no reason room to drop that there, and that's because we've already dropped something there. You can only drop you can drop a bunch of items, but you can only they've got to be like one at a time. I mean I could pick them up and then drop them again. And put them together. Not going to her. <laughs> yeah, so that was a nice, quick, rapid excursion. Just a nice simple tomb, simple graveyard. Surprisingly simple actually. Oh, there's that up there, I didn't see that before. Again, we've got down there as well. I might go and see what this is. It's looking mighty appetising since that's right to the east of town. So that's what that way. Yeah. Probably to, uh, possibly a temple or something. It looks like a building. So it might not be a dungeon, it might just be just a temple or something. Then again, might be wrong. Looks like it's a castle and we've got a way up so we can explore here. This will be fun. See, all these things, I ain't even left the foot. This is just the first town. And that was the way out. <laughs> Don't idiots. I don't care, but since I haven't killed you yet... That is, it wasn't me that killed you. I want to know what is there.
Just no more long sword. Okay. A mithril broadsword. Okay. Four to fifteen. We'll keep in you. Okay, this is a bunch of rooms. Either those magical, probably not, no.
does sort of make you wonder how I know the outlines of these considering I don't think I've ever seen any of these places and these are so dark I think you can sort of see how people could basically live in these games. Still more.
Lizard men don't do stealth. I think we'll finish off this floor. I think there might only be one floor above, but to be honest, I don't want to. Well, I say don't want to risk it. I'll... That's not what I mean. I don't want to. So, oh, it only take five minutes, and next thing you know, two hours later, I'm still kind of grinding away at this level. I don't really need to rest here, but I will. Okay, so. This has been Darvain doing Let's Play Elder Scrolls Arena. If you like what you're seeing here, be sure to like, subscribe, share and comment. Please consider sponsoring me on Patreon. And until next time, goodbye. <laughs>